video will cover optimizing your Magaya database. Before attempting to optimize your database, please make sure that you have updated your system to Magaya 8.5. By completing this optimization, you will greatly reduce the size of your database, making it much more efficient. On average, a 100 gigabyte database will be reduced down to 10 gigabytes. Let's begin. First, we will begin in our Magaya system. We're going to find our configuration options under the maintenance folder and then navigate to the maintenance and performance area. The first step will be to allow the system to recycle records. So we'll check the box next to allow the system to recycle the following records and come to the configuration. What this option will do will be to allow the system to, after a certain number of days, remove the following types of records from the system. We recommend that you keep information from your transaction log, received messages, and sent messages for between 30 to 60 days. You also can adjust how long the system will keep images, other attachments, ocean carrier messages, and customs messages. At this point, we'll need to save the changes. Our next step will be to allow the system to shrink the size of the historical data. This will allow your system to compact the historical data in your database. Once again, we'll click Save. You can continue to use your Magaya system while this process is completed. Once the process is complete, the system will send you a notification alert to let you know that the size of the historical data in the database has been shrunken. Once you've received this alert, you then can move on to tell the system to allow the system to extract heavyweight data, such as images and attachments, to an external file system directory. So we'll check the box and click Save. Once again, you can continue to use your Magaya system as normal while this process takes place in the background. Once again, the system will send you another alert to let you know when the heavyweight data has been extracted from the database to the external file system directory. After this is finished, you will have completed all of the steps inside the Magaya system to optimize your database. After these have been completed, make sure everyone logs out of their Magaya system and you'll be ready to finish the process of optimizing your database. First, you will need to come in and stop your communication server, and then exit from the communication server. Next, you'll need to open your database administrator and run a full backup. Once that has been completed, you can stop your database and then come to Tools, Shrink Database. Once this process has been completed, you will be able to see both the initial and final sizes of your database. My database is not very large, so there is not a big difference in the numbers, but the larger your database is, the greater the results you can expect to see. As stated before, databases where the initial size are often 100 gigabytes can be shrunk down to as low as 10 gigabytes in the final size after the database has been shrunk.
Once this process has been completed, you can restart your Magai database. and then restart your communication server and resume use of your Magaya system as normal.